groups, 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 everybody, groups, 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 groups. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Facebook groups, LinkedIn groups, these are powerful tools to help you with your social media marketing. Today's video is about that. You may not know this, but Facebook groups are almost 10 times more powerful than just using your standard Facebook page. So today's video is gonna be about Facebook groups, LinkedIn groups, and how you can utilize groups to grow your business organically. It's important that you guys know this, so I wanna jump right into it. Let's get rolling. Hey guys, this is Adrian Boysell and welcome back to another training video. So grateful you guys are here. I wanted to make a video specifically about groups to teach you guys how to use groups better. Before we jump into it, if you guys could please hit the like button, subscribe button, so that YouTube shows more of my content to more people like you, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. So if you don't know already, Facebook groups are super powerful. They have high engagement, up to five and even 6% versus a standard page, which can have a quarter percent up to about 1%. So it's important you understand the value of a Facebook group. There are over 10 million Facebook groups currently at the time of recording this that are out on Facebook right now. And I'm sure that number is going to probably double over the next few years. But it's important that you understand that people are using groups to create tribes, to create communities, to create smaller tight knit niches within different industries. So I use Facebook groups. I've been involved in Facebook groups and the beginning of my Facebook group journey started back in about 2014. I was looking for community, I was looking for digital marketers, and through doing some research and talking to a few of my friends, I stumbled upon a group called Job Killing. Job Killing was a group where they were bringing people in from all over the country who had no experience in digital marketing, and they were teaching them the basics of digital marketing, how to sell it, how to build websites, and then rank them. I'm still part of that group today. And although that group was incredibly expensive to join, it was a huge part of my growth as a digital marketer and where I've been able to end up today. The founder of that group, and actually there's two founders, Brad Campbell and Dan Klein. I've given Dan Klein props in my book. Uh, they, they are actually local business owners. One of them is Dan actually lives just up the street from me. And he was able to create a community which now is over 5,000 people that are digital marketers that understand how to build a website, rank that website, and then sell those leads off to other businesses that need them and then make a passive income from them. So I joined this community and I thought, there's nothing that I'm gonna be able to learn about SEO that I don't already know, but if I can learn some sales strategies, if I can have some community, I can do backlinks with people, this could be really, really valuable. So I joined up in this group, spent over $5,000, made a huge investment into myself and into this community, and the money that I've made back has been more than 10X off of that. I can honestly say it's probably been more like 100X of that investment that I've made from that group specifically. Plus, I formed lifelong friendships. In this group, I learned how to sell, I learned how to create contracts, I learned how to do revenue share agreements, I learned a lot of different techniques and stuff that I didn't know about SEO that I didn't realize I didn't even know until I got into the market. So this really helped me level up and reach the next level of my business and take it up to a level where I am now at today. And I've been religious about being in that group and being consistent about adding value into that group and to the other members. So that's something I want you guys to do as well. But in that time, since then, I have joined multiple other groups that are in my field and even outside of my field. I've joined other groups on YouTube like the Billion Dollar Brotherhood that focus on health, wealth, and relationships. So it's impacted my marriage, it's impacted my friendships, it's the impact of the way I do business, and even the way I take care of my own body. So there are different groups for different niches and different industries that you can get yourself involved in. And then I have groups over on LinkedIn. I have solar energy groups. I have contracting groups. I have groups that are for digital marketing. There are all kinds of groups that are on these two platforms that you can build friendships, relationships, network with, and it's a really powerful way for you to create yourself as an authority in these groups. Facebook has a group that I've also jumped into called ClickFunnels that allows you to network with every single person that does ClickFunnels. Some of you guys may love ClickFunnels, some of, you, some of you guys may hate it, but ClickFunnels is a powerful tool that many digital marketing marketers are using. So if you're trying to reach designers, you're trying to reach digital marketers, finding Facebook groups like we have is a powerful resource and tool for you to be able to grow your reach. So I've been using these, I've been able to more than 10X my business since using Facebook groups, and now because I've seen all the success that has come from them, 
Back at the beginning of the year, I started putting together my own community and my own group. And it's only been a couple months where I've actually started bringing in members, but it's called the Instagraphics Pro Network. And that group is specifically designed for graphic designers, web designers, motion designers, and I bring them in. And I'm constantly, on a daily basis, at least five days a week, if not seven days a week, I'm adding value into that group. I take videos like these and I put them in the group for free. I do Q and A's, I do interviews, I do trainings, I do tips, I do motivational stuff, I do posts, I share my life. And then I have other people in the group sharing their life and their tips and their trainings. And so it's not just a one way street, is I'm offering value and there are other people that are inspired by that and they're offering value into the group. So whether you have a group of 100 or you have a group of 100,000, it doesn't matter. You can build communities, you can build tribes. The point is to create that community and create that network that is gonna help you leverage people that are in your community, that are in your niche and that are in your field of expertise to help you grow your reach and to help you become better at what you do. We should all be in the mindset to help our industry. There are too many people out there that are looking at everybody as their competitor and they don't want to be in a group together with a bunch of other designers. That is a bad negative mindset that is going to be, it's called scarcity mindset that is going to hold you back from getting the success that you really want. Once you start seeing what other people are doing, you start sharing information, that allows you to level up your game. And Facebook groups are the way that I'm doing that in 2020. A lot of these restaurants are struggling and there are groups that are happening now like anti uh, mask wearing and pro mask wearing groups. These are polarizing topics in our society nowadays and you can be in either group or in both groups and you can see firsthand how people are interacting and engaging in groups like that. And then you can have groups that are just fun that are about your local community or local games or taco night, things like that. So Facebook groups are a powerful tool for you to be able to leverage in your business that are going to help you increase your reach, help you create more freedom, help you get traffic to your websites, to your landing pages, to your YouTube channels. These are all great ways to leverage your groups, but just make sure that you're adding value. At the end of the day, you'll hear me talk about this. Like I'm going to hit it like it's a dead horse. You need to be adding value in every place that you're conversating. It's not just about taking, but it's about giving value and sharing your knowledge, sharing your passion, sharing your expertise with people. So that's what I got for you guys today on the Facebook groups. If you guys want to join our Facebook group, all you got to do is go to Facebook, look up the Instagraphics Pro Network. This group is for people that want to reach their full potential in their career. They want to get more freedom. They want to have more balance. They want to have more community. And that's what we're going to be doing there. Trainings, tips, Q and A's, all these great things. So I would love for you guys to join us. I'll drop the link down in the description and I'll see you guys on the next video. I'm Adrian Boisel. Thank you for watching. And as always, keep looking up.